everybody, Gamer Penny here, bringing you another episode of our World of Warcraft Classic Let's Play, and we're doing a little something different today. <laughs> um, we're going to take a break from questing and leveling, and we're going to do the seasonal events. So I stopped in Ogremar, and I got the um, quests there. I bought some gingerbread um, things off of the auction house and some milk and turned it in and we got a present so maybe we should open that present first 10 mage royal really <laughs> well <laughs> that was our present um from great father winter but he also uh we have two more quests to do one we've got to find some stolen winter veil treats and that's actually not on this continent um it's up in alteric valley i will go try to do that today as well but the one we're here doing is this level 60 quest which you don't have to be level 60 to do. Um, you actually could do it around probably level 45-ish uh, solo. I'm banking on the fact that we have a pet and there might be other people out there doing it. <laughs> uh, but we're going to give it a try. And to do that, we're going to be going into a zone that we've never been in before, which is Tenaris. Um, so, we're going to go rescue this reindeer. <laughs> As part of the Winter Vale celebration going on in the world of Warcraft. But to do that, we had to come through the Shimmering Flats. And we do have a quest to turn in. So I'm going to sidetrack just for a little bit to go turn in that quest. And then continue on to Tenaris. And we'll be able to get the gadgets and a flight path. Um, and then make our way down. You can see it's marked on the map for us. Uh, thank you to Questy <laughs> for that, because I wasn't sure how to find it. Man, it's been a while since we've been back here, but we do have this quest to turn in the uh, goblin. You know what? Since we're doing this, let's turn off all this other... We'll pick them back up. Or we'll... Uh... We'll track them later in the next episode. Okay. That's what we're working on today. Let's turn off, uh, let's get back to our video chat here. Bum 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 bum. We're gonna do a little bit of the Winter Veil stuff just cause I, I remember doing it back in, back in, um, Vanilla. But I, I can't, like, remember the details. <laughs> like, I thought we got to open presents um, under the tree. That might be on Christmas, so. And I feel regular. I did. There you go. Speak with Razorick on the Shimmering Flats. Is he, like, right here? He is right here. Ah, I'm stuck. Here we go. Okay, complete that quest. Retrieve the C4 and booster from Razorick. Uh, being sent on crashed and dust while on marsh. Okay. We have another quest to go somewhere else, which we might. We might do that. Level 41, which is not bad. You know, we might go to Dustwall and Marsh um, eventually because we got now a couple quests to head out there. But for now, hmm, can I pick up that Gazrilla one? Because isn't Gazrilla the carrot on a stick one? Is that what I'm thinking of? Pleased to meet you. <laughs> Bring Gazrilla's electrified scale. The Wizzle Brass will. Um. Increases mount speed by three. Be seeing you. I want Need that. Assistance? But, um. Alrighty how do you get then. the hammer again? I'm gonna have to look that up. But we're gonna hang on to that one. That's definitely a dungeon I'm gonna try to get into. Uh, to get the carrot on a stick. Even if we have to do it, like... Uh, 
uh, at max level or something. Oh, lots of hunters out here. Okay, onward. We're going to Tenaris for the first time, and you go up this little path to get there. I was gonna say, what made that scorch mark on there? Bum bum. We have to remember to get the flight path so we don't have to make this run again next time. We're level 40, so very shortly, in the next like few levels, we'll probably be coming out here to quest. Which this is one of my favorite zones. Although with one of my least favorite quests is that escorting. That's out here, right? The escorting of the chicken? <laughs> That's in vanilla, right? There we go. And here's Gadget Zan. Wanted posters. There's all sorts of stuff here. What is a level 8 doing out here? <laughs> He'd like pull this thing standing over there. All right, down we go. We're going down here. What's this? Oh, God's realos. Okay. Uh oh. I wasn't paying attention. Can't look away. <laughs> we are uh, in over our head here a little bit. Although they're only level forty-one. That guy was forty-three, was he not? What's this? Whoops. Oh no. <laughs> we get out of here, please. Okay. Let's get back on our wolf and focus. <laughs> Can't be pulling these things. That's a cool looking scorpion, a pink one. That's one true scorp's girlfriend. Cool looking scorpion. I like <laughs> I like that one a lot actually. I like the one we have though too. Yeah, this is where they start to get a little bit higher. I saw 45 in there. So this reindeer is going to be surrounded by level 45 and 46 mobs. But I think what we could do is send our pet in. We have to use this pouch of reindeer dust on Metzen to free him. While the pet's all distracted and everything, we can free the reindeer. Complete the quest that way, I think. <laughs> We're gonna give it a go, at least. Uh, it might turn out very, very poorly. But we can't say that we didn't try. Hmm. I know where this is now. This dang pirate cove. Man, the memories from this cove. Bum, 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 bum. No pirates in this cave, right? It's just when you get to the other side, I think. Yeah. Get Scorp out as a second line of defense here. 44. Okay. If we go along the edge, we should find him in a little cage. Is that a ship out there? That's awesome. Mm -hmm. A level 60 rogue. Maybe we can convince this rogue to help us. If we need it. Although he's just out here fishing, so. Coming through. 
the level 43 warrior. Man, there's lots of people out here. Can we see, uh... Hey. You shooting me? You know what, I got something to say to you. Okay, actually killing them as long as we only pull one at a time. Although Scorp's taunts are gonna get resisted over and over again. He's only 39, right? Yeah. That's just our damage here. Oh, and they run. It's very, very dangerous. Don't mind me, just out here. Can't... Okay, are all these people gonna come out here and uh, do medicine? That's, is that why everyone's out here? Hey. Lots of people. Man, he is very much surrounded. I'm gonna see what these other people do first. <laughs> like, anyone need Firebeard? No. I came for the reindeer. There he is, right there. <laughs> I came for the reindeer. <laughs> <What's that? laughs> I correct myself up. Oh. <laughs> Let's see if they go in there. <laughs> I'm just here for fire. Don't know the reindeer quest. I wonder if I can share him. No, oh, we're. He's over there. Go kill these people. Did this guy die? I just kind of watched this guy die. I didn't realize that he was uh, dying over here. Level 60, um... This is much more heavily guarded than I thought it would be when we came out here. Oh my god, dude. Do you even... It's level 45, I can't kill that thing for you. Try to help you. I mean, I'm level 40. <laughs> I'm not gonna do a whole lot. Oh god. Saw him. The fire beat or that's the character the guy you needed. Um what if I send Scorpion? It's very, very much more heavily guarded than I had anticipated it to be. Hey, dude, you wanna go clear that reindeer? Are we being shot? We are. Well, okay. With that being said, Scorp, just, just go, go wild. Oh god! 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 Hey, hey, Metzen. I can't. Sprinkle. Well, we did it. <laughs> All right, quest completed. 
And with that being said, we will suffer the consequences of this because that is a no win situation <laughs> trying to get back out of there. Perfect. Uh, Scorp, you served your purpose, pur purpose well. Let's get you up and get you fed. Um, do I turn this back into someone in Ogremar? Because if I have to turn it back into him, screwed. Yes. Okay. Well then. Um, the other stuff is in Alteric Valley. So, I think our Hearthstone will be back up by the time we get there, maybe? How long does it take? What's the cooldown? An hour. It won't be. But <laughs> well, that's okay. We're gonna hearth back to Ogremar. Turn this in to Santa. Um. Not to Santa. To Santa's helper here. Mets in the reindeer. We did it. Preserved Holly. This is going to... Who did we just, um... Now friendly with Booty Bay. Interesting. Ah, potential customer. I got what you need. Wonder if I should buy these for when we get cooking. I'm gonna do it. Okay. And then let's stop at the bank. Like I said, guys, this is gonna be a real laid back kind of tooling around type episode. Um, we're not gonna accomplish a whole lot, but we did get that quest done. And actually, did that give us some experience? <laughs> like, I feel like we're up a little farther. All right, what don't I need? We need to clear some stuff out here. Um, probably get rid of... Jeez. Maybe one of these silver contacts, but you know what? Um, get rid of the tin ore, and then we'll put this stuff in here and this stuff in here. I can't use either of these, right? One sixty-five. Okay. Farewell. Let's just straight up sell the tin ore because that doesn't go for a whole lot on the auction house. So we'll sell that, and then we're gonna hop on the zeppelin. Yeah. What do you want? Don't get smart with me. All right, let's hop on the zip. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Go to Undercity. And from Undercity... That. Under, like, Eastern Plaguelands. We have to get here. Um, honestly, we want to go to South Shore. No, we want to go to um, Terran Mill. I was thinking Alliance for a second. I missed the buffs. <laughs> Undercity, we'll fly to Terran Mill. Then we'll try to find these stolen winter veil treats. And then we will have done the seasonal stuff. There's also a seasonal uh, daily. But I tell you what, it's level 48. And, and we won't be able to do that. <laughs> <laughs> that, that would be heck trying to trying to get that one done. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, can I be become a little? I got what you need. Perfect. Keep it real. Very seasonal. <laughs> For thirty minutes, we're little. And his helper. Bum, 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 bum. Reckless zone. Wog. Okay. Can't mount here. Fine. <laughs> but I just bought my mount and I want to show it off. Has that always been there? <laughs> what? 
What is that? <laughs> what am I staring at? Have I just never noticed that before? No, that couldn't have always been there. That's That came with, like, Nax or something, right? I had to have. Sorry, I'm chewing an ice cube. <laughs> I got, uh, some fruit punch Mio in my water. Some crushed ice. Here it comes, here it comes, the Zeppelin. Um, let's take a look at the LFGs and see what's up. I see no ZF groups, which sucks because I really, really want that carrot on a stick. Maybe if we were to like hang out in Tenaris and be like, hey, anyone want to go to ZF? We'd find a group. But we'd also have to find someone with the mallet for the gone. See, we're gonna- I don't think we're gonna have a problem getting into a BFD group. Or B- I mean, sorry. A BRD group. Which is gonna be... Like, he's level 56. So once we get up there, I think we'll be okay. We just have to get there. And our gear is gonna be really bad for a while. <laughs> Although we did get these. Those aren't super fantastic. Oh, I was like, why is everything- why is everything so bad? Oh! ZF. See, you just gotta keep the faith. I had lost it for quite a while. Wait, am I on the right Zeppelin? We'll find out. <laughs> I feel so- I feel like I am. Where's Ogrimmar? I didn't get turned around, right? I don't think I'm on the right Zeppelin. I don't- We'll find out where we go. I don't think I'm on the right one. I think I needed to be on that one. <laughs> I think I got on the- I think I got on the wrong one. I think we're going to Gromgall. How'd I get so turned around? Shoot. <laughs> we can just ride it back and then. <laughs> oh, dang it. Yeah, we're going to Gromgo. <laughs> Shoot, man. How did I make that mistake? <sighs> I was so excited to be a gnome, I think. Alright, well, let's just stay on and... Where does that one go now? Or does that one not move? That one just always stayed there. I'm gonna go find out. You know what? Let's go see. Where does this one lead? We're gonna explore. <laughs> it's like, oh, this one goes to Ogremar. <laughs> ah, Scorp's hungry again. I guess we'll find out where this one goes. It'd be great if it went to Undercity. Where else would it go? Thunderbluff? Oh, 
perfect. See, our exploration paid off. We just took, we took the long way. Okay, and then from here, we will fly to Aaron Rail. I'll turn it around today. Now I gotta find my way through Undercity. That, okay, now I know that this is just brand new with Nax. <laughs> Cause that thing has not always been here either. Dawn. We're gonna see my favorite thing. This throne is my favorite thing in World of Warcraft, I think. Cause it's just so spooky looking, you know? It was a very good throne room and then... It just speaks of the city just being overrun and killed. Do we have any news on classic Burning Crusade? <laughs> is that is that a thing? Maybe they'll announce it at BlizzCon or something this year. All right, looking for you. What is it? And we're going to Baron Mill. Oh, dismount first. Get out of here. Where? Okay, they could have made that change to classic. It's, it automatically dismounts you. <laughs> Doesn't have to be no change. <laughs> this could be just small, very dismount me when I'm on my mount. Oh, what's all down here? I'm looking for like what level some of these crown of will. I could have picked that up. I just want to make sure that I've got a understanding of where our quests lie. Like I said, we're probably going to run out of them. Uh, although, I, I honestly, I don't think it's going to be where everyone was telling me it was. We're like mid 40s. It's going to be late 40s and mid 50s. Uh, is when we're going to run out of easy quests, I suppose. But by mid 50s, you could be hopping into some um, BRDs, some end zone or end end game um, dungeons. All right, we got it right here. If only I could hop off this bat. Oh, no one's out here killing these things now. <laughs> we could have, we could do it now. We just gotta go up here. And it looks like we could get up that way if we have to. Um, or we might be able to get up through here too. Okay. Actually, I think that's probably gonna be the way we go. Keeping my eye on it so I know <laughs> where to go. Ooh, how do we get. Oh, we gotta go all the way around there. Okay. No problem, no problem. Bracers of Binding is the quest that we could not complete because everyone was out there killing those stone things. Alright, let's get going. We gotta get these Winter Veil Treats. 
recovered. So we can turn them in and maybe we'll get a cool prize from this one. Bum bum bum. Bum 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 bum. Right. Get up here. Yes, okay. I'm gonna go in here. I know this zone from the uh, retail one. This is where you come and kill... Kill a Yeti, right? Like the... This would be like the Grinch. <laughs> they still do that, right? I don't know. Level are these? Oh, we're fine. Why is this marked as 60? Is it gonna be like a... Big level thing over here. Oh. oh my god, it's a snowman. Okay, I don't I don't know what uh what's gonna come of this, so let's just get prepared just in case. You can hear me think the the bottom line. I'm not really a snowman. My name is Sax, and I work for the Orgrimmar branch of Smoky Wood Pastures. Got sent out here to look for a missing package when I was attacked by a creature I've never seen before. So very cold. A creature called the Abominable Grinch. Oh, okay. Is the one who stole our shipment of treats, Maze. Uh, be careful, though. He is the one who turned me into a snowy mess. You're gonna need some help in facing him. I've seen him wander all around here, the Yeti are. He's surely here somewhere. Find the treats maze, take them back to Smoky Pasture uh, in Ogrimar, and tell them I need to be unfrozen. <laughs> okay. The Bonneral Grinch. The Grinch. We could do... Is humanoid? They are. Any... Any Grinches? The Grinch one is probably the one that's, uh, elite and... way over our... But maybe, um... This? The snowball? Is this how you get snowballs? No! I was getting some snowballs, man! Oh, if you don't have growl on, that's why. I'm gonna get some snowballs. Does he spawn at certain times, maybe? even be like over here too. Let's um... Ooh, are, what level are these guys? Hi. 40 elites. Very, very interesting. We are gonna have a rough time. I don't think anyone's out here doing this. So, are we doing this for nothing? Quite possible. Any wrenches? I just kind of want to get out of this ogre area. I feel like they want to put him in the outer area, right? I'm 
Now, my question is, um, does he spawn at certain times? I feel like maybe that's the way they're doing it. You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Not seeing him. He's like a 35 elite. Uh, we could probably get him then, but if he's like 40 something elite, it's gonna be a time and a half. It doesn't say like. I'm just worried I'm going to run past him. <laughs> so I'm just looking up here. Oh, Grinch. Where are you, Grinch? Good. I don't say he's like up there, though, either. And I'm making the assumption that he's just like a yeti and a humanoid. What if he's not? I don't see why he wouldn't be. Hmm. <laughs> I'm just... Do these snowballs have a... Uh... No. Like I say, if they only last for seven days, then I won't pick them up, but like to have a few snowballs. <laughs> Mountain Yeti, giant Yeti, Mountain Yeti, giant Yeti. Interesting. No Grinch. No Grinch to be found. Just Yetis. Maybe he'd do a, um, like a yell or something. Battle guards and Yetis. And there are, it's just kind of all on the outside, really. Uh, I don't think it's going to be in that ogre area. We could just like keep running back and forth, but I'm not going to put you guys through that. Be a great way to end the episode though, to find the Grinch and get these things, these things back. You're a mean one. There he is. <laughs> uh, level 36 elite. Think we could take him? We're 40. We'll get him, Scorp. We're gonna give it a go. You're a mean one. Mr. Grinch. Bum, bum, bum. Mr. Grinch. Hey, Scorp. Um, do you think you could pull him off me? Thank you, because I would very much like to range fight him. Oh, Scorp got turned into a snowman! <laughs> Oh no! Score! Okay, he's back. <laughs> Yay! Oh, stolen treats. We got him. 
Fantastic. Alright, now we gotta get back to Ogremar to turn these in. Quickest way would probably be if you're looking for the Grinch. I already took care of him, bud. Soloed. <laughs> like that's big accomplishment. <laughs> like four levels higher. Oh, what am I doing? We gotta mount now. The thing is, is it faster, uh, mounting faster than Cheetah? 30%? 60%, it is. It just seems slower for some reason. Mr. Grinch. That song's gonna be stuck in my head for days. Wonder if they're all up there looking for the Grinch. Okay, I fastest way back to Ogremar. Undercity. Oh, I hate it. <laughs> You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Mm -mm -mm. Man, we were looking for a uh, Christmas movie. It's you know, it's gonna it's gonna sound a little sad, but it's not not real bad. Uh, we were supposed to go through like a Christmas lights at the zoo sort of thing, and we went to go buy our tickets. Uh, they were sold out because <laughs> we didn't buy them. We didn't buy them quick enough. Uh, so what we did instead is we ordered some Olive Garden, and then we were looking for a Christmas movie to watch. And we were going through all the Christmas movies, and uh, honestly, all of them were kind of like, eh, don't really want to watch one. Maybe let's choose an action movie instead, because <laughs> it's kind of sort of like the Die Hard thing, but we, uh, we wound up choosing Lethal Weapon, the first one. And I did not remember it at all, but it's set during Christmas, so it was perfect. <laughs> it was like a, a Christmas movie. So everyone says Die Hard's the Christmas movie, but... Man, are we forgetting Lethal Weapon was during Christmas as well? <laughs> uh, it's pretty good. Although, it, it wasn't the Lethal Weapon I remember, and I think when I think of Le Lethal Weapon, I think of Lethal Weapon 2, maybe. What's the one where he sits on the toilet and it's like a bomb? <laughs> That's the one I remember the most. So it was like watching it for the first time, because I was... It's like, I don't remember this movie at all. <laughs> I think I always watch two or three. It might have been three, maybe. That was what we did instead to have a little Christmas kickoff. It's kind of a bummer about the zoo, but also um, we thought it was a drive, like a drive through to see the, the lights, but it was actually a walk through. And I don't think my, I don't think my dad would have made it very far without having to get a chair. So it was kind of decent that we just kind of stayed home and watched a movie instead. But it was funny because like we were looking through all these Christmas movies. Like, eh, <laughs> we almost settled on a Muppet Christmas Carol. But then my cat accidentally turned it off and we all realized that we were uninvested in the movie. <laughs> it just... It happens sometimes, you know? Alright, take a look at my favorite spooky area. Mr. Grinch! And I think when this goes up, it is going to be uh, Christmas week. I hope you all have, uh, if you celebrate, and even if you don't, hope you all have a great Christmas week and you get to spend the holidays with family. And if not, I hope you have a good one. Yes. Oh, now we're red. Uh, of course, it just smells. I should have known. Mr. Grinch. 
told you I'm gonna be singing that for the rest of the day, probably. All right, here we are. Wait, where does this one go? What's up? Oh, Grimar. Okay. Yes, that's where, that's where I wanted to go. We'll turn this in. I wonder what you get off of this. It doesn't show you. Hopefully something cool. Maybe... When did they start handing out, like, outfits? Because hey, if I could get a Christmas hat... <laughs> Even if it was cosmetic, um, I would I would wear it. This this girl's name is Second Breakfast. <laughs> uh good stuff, good stuff. I need a second breakfast. Like three o'clock, and I <laughs> yeah, it's two twenty four, and uh. I'm already thinking about food. Where are they getting these shoulders? Worry, worry. Is that uh, an axe shoulder? Let me see. Hmm. Yeah, these are raiders. Conquerors spelled it. No, conquerors. That's PvP, right? Conquerors? Eh, it might be, uh. Let's see, scout. Sergeant. Yeah, it could be PvP. Yeah, if, with a set bonus of slow effect, I feel like that's PvP gear, right? Like set five. And he's got just amazing gear. I mean, honestly, that could be how we gear up at max level. Get PvP gear. PvP as a hunter? Uh, Mr. Grinch. Got, got really good gear. Hmm. I think that's crafted, right? The Lionheart helm? That's a crafted helm. I think I remember that. Got Hakar, so he was in ZG. Ah. Interesting. Yeah, I never thought of that, maybe, for max level. As if, um... If rating doesn't look great. PvPing? How do you get the, um... Like, because I'm not gonna win. <laughs> That's it. Let me just throw that out there, first and foremost. I won't be winning uh, any stuff, like, in... Um arenas or anything we'll just be like if we did pvp we'd be doing battlegrounds and let me take a look what if i should jump into a battleground just to give it a go Oh, very interesting. <laughs> I was just like sitting here thinking that is something we could do if we get to a certain level and need some gear. We could get the hunter PvP gear. We can't 
can't get into a raid. But, I mean, we're watching, like, the raids. They're the LFG, and there's tons of raids. Um, you know, I'm looking for... Here's a hunter looking for Oni and MC. Like, there, there's people that raid out there. BRD. I think we'll be okay. We just won't be, uh, we're not going to be in a set, you know, a set schedule for raiding. And I'm not going to join, I had to look up what this was, DKP. I'm not going to join a group that does that. Um, that the DKP means you, basically whoever can pay the most when a, when a, uh, peace drops that's who wins it and <laughs> to me I'm like uh, here's me in my you know 11 gold <laughs> that's not I'm not gonna be able to do that sort of stuff we would get nothing out of it and I want to get you know I want to get or potentially get some gear if we go into a raid bum, 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 bum. I think if we were going to get raid gear, we'd probably want to join a guild. They could help us get up there. <clears throat> but PvP, you could probably get that gear solo, huh? What do you think? Just jump into a boat. You'd have to do a crap ton of battlegrounds. But I like the uh, classic battlegrounds, so. Talk to me. All right. Do we get anything from it? Speak with Great Father Winter and Orgrimmar. Okay. And uh, can I have a present? Alright, what did we get in our gift? Snowmaster 9000. Teaches how to make a Snowmaster 9000. It allows an experienced engineer to you turn water into a snowball. Snowmaster requires a day to build up enough chill to freeze another snowball. That's kind of cool, actually. Because <laughs> we're an engineer. Okay. Oh. Well, we'll put that in the bank. And that was the seasonal stuff. Um, I think on Christmas you actually can open presents. I feel like you can still do that in uh, in classic. Get rid of this stuff. Okay. Uh, but we'll see. So guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode there. Thanks for like just hanging out with me in this episode. We didn't do you know too much questing. We actually did get quite a bit of experience from when we started but we were just doing the seasonal stuff just tooling around and having fun so i want to thank you guys so much for all of your support on this series if you do want to see more of the world of warcraft classic let's play make sure to leave a like or subscribe to the channel otherwise i will see you guys next time all right bye everyone